What is going on guys? So today we're going to be taking a look at Meshtastic on the Liligo T-Deck Pro. I finally get a chance to uh, remove this uh, beautiful paperweight from my desk and actually do something with it. So um, right now I have Launcher installed, okay, and uh, I do have the uh, unofficial bin loaded for uh, the Meshtastic firmware. So I'm just gonna go ahead and select SD card and then go to the firmware.factory, that's right here. And then we're gonna go ahead and click install. And we are going to wait, shouldn't take too long. Um, the thing about these e-papers, obviously they have to refresh the screen in order for it to show any progress. So we'll just wait. I'm really happy that there's been pro progress for this device because it's beautiful. It's a very nice, lightweight device that you can just put in your pocket. And uh, uh, the keyboard is completely different than the original uh, T-Dex and things like that. So uh, when they came out with this keyboard, it, it, it's a much better feeling keyboard. Uh, but there are some, well, there's one thing that bothers me about it, and that's the backlight. It's terrible. It's the worst I've seen. I'd rather just have no backlight on this keyboard than to actually have it. So, all right, so we got Meshtastic installed. So we'll just wait for it to, to load up here and it's gonna ask me for my region and I am in Europe 868. That one, all right. And forgive me as I am trying to figure this out. Rebooting. Let's see if it actually did the 868. I'm not sure. This is gonna be the first time I'm seeing this and setting it up, so uh, forgive me if uh, I don't know. There we go. So in the top left corner, we have Euro 868, which is the frequency that uh, is being used where I'm at. And then you can see 2.7.1 is the firmware. And then let's see, what else do we have? So there's no satellites right now. Battery voltage is good. Honestly, I have no idea. Looks like they've changed it a little bit. So let's see here. All right, so cool. So here we are with like the menu. All right, we've got the home, the messages. I don't know what this is. Let's see, last heard. We have the hops and sigs. Distance, uh, bearings, position. All right, so our LoRa info, system, so the things about the device, and of course the time, which actually is pretty cool. So is this the correct time? Uh, no, not for me anyways. I cannot change that on the settings soon, but uh, let's go ahead and take a look. Let's go to home. Can I go home? No, that's not what I want to do. Okay, so I'm guessing we have to keep tapping till we get to that. Oh, perfect. So we've got 12 satellites. There's no one on. So let's see. No messages. What can I do? Should I go just type something? Oh, cool. Yeah, so we're just going to go. Actually, I'll just do... Do hola since I'm in Spain. Hey, it went right through. You can hear the uh, sense cap alert us that uh, we got a new message. And this that is actually linked to my phone through the Meshtastic app. So that's pretty cool. All right, so if we go here, there's no messages. All right, last heard, I don't know. Let's, let's silence that, sorry. All right, is there any? So obviously this firmware is uh, unofficial. So it does use some of the official stuff, but this is not an official release from Meshtastic. So, and it is definitely a, uh, Let's move it just like that. It's hard to get that without the glare. There we go. Um, so right now we have two satellites, two online, probably this and 
maybe my phone or we'll find out but uh but yeah it doesn't really show too much oh okay so we can swipe and see it's just showing us different things but yeah this is this is a working uh a working firmware so I'm actually pretty happy that we were, we're progressing in a forward direction instead of staying stagnant or, you know, this device just kind of being forgotten about. Because um, it's definitely a really nice device considering it has the e-paper display and the battery will last a lot longer than, you know, your LCD screens and TFT screens and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, that is pretty much it for this. It's just a quick video, um, kind of showing off Meshtastic on the T-Deck Pro. If you guys have any questions, just leave them down in the comments. I can try to answer them as best I can. Uh, like the video if you guys liked it, dislike it if you didn't, and, uh, subscribe if you haven't. It really helps me out a lot. I'm so close to 500 subs, uh, so if you guys subscribed, it would help me out a ton. But, um, yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you guys in the next one.